Ron Palawan, the best among the rest. An island hoping I won't forget. I won't wonder why Karan is the first class municipality in the province of Palawan. Why? Because I see it myself. I don't have any idea about its economic status. But what I know is how wonderful, beautiful, and perfect sceneries of every beaches and islet it has. It's great for divers, couples, beach lovers, and for a family vacation. A magical environment and the most picture-perfect spots in the Philippines. It's the Coron Island that has the most unimaginable and breathtaking sights you would never expect. Coron is a tropical island that has a unique charm of its own. Located a 30-minute boat ride from the town on the largest island in the archipelago, Busuanga Island. We arrived in Coron via ferry from El Nido. However, if from Manila, the fastest way to get on the island is to fly by a Cebu Pacific or Philippine Airlines. Here in Quran, everything is amazing. Not only that their prices are cheaper, compared to other cities in Palawan, from meals and restaurants, accommodations, tour packages, bars, etc. But also its priceless sceneries that offers crystal clear fresh water lakes, shallow water coral reefs, limestone coast landscape, and beautiful beaches. You can do everything and anything on its stunning islands and enjoy beach camping, scuba or wreck diving, quality snorkeling, and mountain hiking. Come, let's go at a skeleton wreck. Would you like to experience seeing the actual World War II shipwreck? A skeleton reef is the perfect site for you. It's a great feeling having seen a ship that was sunk in the year 1944, according to our tour guide. We arrive here with few crowds. It's so good for us to have a clear visibility of the ship. So, I suggest if you want to see the shipwreck clearly, then come here earlier. The lesser crowd would be, the clearer the water. As you dive and snorkel, you'll see the top of the wreck about 6 meters above the surface of the water and approximately 20 meters to the bottom of the ship. If you are skillful at freediving, then you can enter and exceed the inner areas of the ship because there are a few small windows and inlets into the shipwreck. By the way, it was called the skeleton wreck because it came from the fact that the ribs of the wreck were left, showing a skeletal appearance. The wreck was encrusted in coral and barnacles. Along with beautiful fishes, join us while we swim and dive on the shipwreck. about this place. Did you like it? Then click like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to ring the notification bell for you to get updated. See you till then!
Hindi na po. Okay. Wala po ito. catch a short well check the other videos here in quran on my youtube channel and browse allandims.com to know more about the other places that you'd wish to visit soon and don't forget to like share and subscribe and ring the notification bell below for you to be updated on the upcoming videos copy our strategies to enjoy every moment plan better and plan ahead see you in our next tour Thank <laughs> you.